हेलो एवरीवन सब्सक्राइब कीजिए हमारे चैनल को और दबाइए इस घंटे को एंड नेवर मिस अ वीडियो फ्रॉम कंप्यूटर दैट इज अ शोइंग सम मेनूज ऑन दिस डिस्प्ले दैट इज अ फील्ड बस एप्लीकेशन दिस ट्रांसमीटर द फील्ड बस प्रोटोकॉल सो वी शुड बी इनेबल शुड बी सेलेक्टेड फील्ड बस मेनू एज दिस फॉर सम डिफिकल्ट कम्युनिकेशन नाउ इट इज टेकिंग दैट ऑनली मोड विल टेक सम मिनट्स दैट इज अ वन वार्निंग मैसेज विल कम इन दिस कम्युनिकेटर इट सेलेक्ट एज इट इज अ टू आस्क द परमिट टू एंटर द सेगमेंट दिस इज मेंट टू कनेक्ट टू द कंटेंट सेगमेंट दैट इज अ लॉट ऑफ इंस्ट्रूमेंट कनेक्टेड सो इट इज रीडिंग द सेगमेंट हाउ मेनी इंस्ट्रूमेंट इज कनेक्टेड दीज आर द दीज आर द इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स दैट बी कनेक्टेड ऑन दिस सेगमेंट सो नाउ आवर टैग नंबर इज नेशनल ट्रांसमीटर सो आवर बी टी फोर सिक्स टू सेवन टू जीरो एज आवर टैग नंबर नाउ आई सेलेक्ट दिस टैग नंबर एंड सी द सेलेक्ट यूजिंग द थ्रू एरो कम्युनिकेटर जस्ट क्लिक द एंटर इट इज टेकिंग सम मिनट्स टू रीड दैट ऑल डेटा स्टोर ऑन द ट्रांसमीटर When you enter the transmitter, it tells there is some blocks. There is a resource block, transmitter block one, transmitter block two, transmitter block three, and analog input. So our tag number with analog input needs to be entered this particular analog input to do the loop test. Once you enter that particular analog input, there is a showing quick config, common config, and advanced config, and other things, IO references and timers. So to check the range of this transmitter, we should be enter that quick config. There is showing. Some parameters of the transmitter. So now you are seeing that there is a range of this transmitter as well as the name of the gun. The transmitter's name is so there is a 0 to 15 volt. There is a U R B and L L. And come to that and go to that launch config. Here it was selecting the simulation, simulation, enable and disable. Now it is going to the disable mode. Now I go to the active. Then the active. Now it is activated. So as per that our There is a zero already sent to that DCS control room. Now display showing zero in DCS room. So we are seeing that value of this display as well as that DCS side. There is same value will show in connection section. Come to that back and select that advanced config. Now I applied that for 50 percentage to do the loop test. Now we have applied that for partition. As well as zero percentage, twenty-five percentage, fifty percentage, and seventy-five percentage, hundred percentage. Okay. Already I have applied that zero as a zero percentage. Now I applied that twenty-five percentage, three point seven five. Okay. Select okay and click the send. Now you can see that value. How much you will be receive on the DCS side? Three point seven five as a twenty-five percentage. Now I want to make that fifty percentage. It means seven point five. So just enter that your value for fifty percentage. Click okay. And it is sent. Now you can see the display side. We are showing the value as a 7.5 for 50 percentage. For 75 percentage, I enter that value in advanced config. Select the simulation value 11 11.25 as a 75 percentage. Now I enter the value. Click sent. Now it is the value will show in this room as a 11.25 or 75 percentage. Now I want to make that 100 percentage into the 50. This is a maximum range U or V means upper range value. I enter the value 15 bar, send, and come to back, go to connector. That DCS side will show 15 bar. Okay. So now I make it over range of this transmitter 15 point. 16. Okay, 16 as a over range. Let's okay. Click send. You can see that DCS side, DCS room or control room. There is a 16 bar. I want to make the normal. Go to the zero. Select zero. Send. Okay. Now it is showing that normal. Come to the automatic number zero. Now go to the simulation deactive mode. That it will take as a normal also. So now you can see that value. Now this value will change now. This is the actual line pressure showing. Okay, so this is the loop test procedures. Now I am showing. Now come to back and come to back. Come to back and go to back. Now almost finished. Okay, this loop test is finished. Now I make. Now I make the back.